Hey everybody, welcome back to my channel, and if you are new, welcome in. I am LeBron Jade, and today we are playing RE2 for a special day. It is my freaking birthday, so we are playing Leon A. Claire B. Now, we, if you're familiar with the channel, we did start playing Leon A. Claire B, but I decided to go back and start for Claire A. Leon B, so we did complete that on the channel. I'll have the links down below, but today it is time for my first experience of Leon A. proper and Claire B all the way through to the end. So I am beyond excited and I wanted to say thank you all so much. Every year I like to reflect and this past year has been incredible. Look at this, look at this. You guys are freaking amazing. Smashing the like button, leaving the comments, leaving the requests. If it wasn't for you guys, I probably wouldn't be doing this right now. And that is just honest and thank y'all so much for always coming back supporting my content and watching i'm so happy to get this started so without any further ado let's turn it up and let's get freaking started Resident Evil. all right maybe maybe a little too loud there <laughs> let's turn it back down all right i'm so excited it's been way too long since I've been back here in RE2. A bizarre incident occurred in the outskirts of an American suburb called Raccoon City. It was later revealed mm -hmm. that the terrible disaster had been caused by the T virus, mm -hmm. a mutagenic toxin created by the international enterprise Umbrella Incorporated Umbrella for Incorporated. use in bioweapon experiments. The Raccoon City Police Department's Special Stars Unit immediately began investigation in the affair. The case was apparently closed mm -hmm. thanks to the efforts of Stars, stars members Chris Redfield and Jill Valentine. But the Umbrella Corporation's experiments were far from finished. Enter RE2 timeline, which starts if I'm not mistaken, a day after RE3's timeline, now that I've played that, now I know what you guys were commenting on when y'all said, it's funny she doesn't know that this window, uh, why it's broken. And now I get it. Y'all are so funny. Now I understand. What have we got here? Haha, <laughs> the Japanese subtitles. God, I love this. It's so tense, this buildup. <laughs> Guys, I'm a maniac. Why did he fight me? <laughs> Tax a go. Mess. What could have done this? What was that? Behind you, rookie. What Zombies on the things? left. Zombies on the right. All right, that's far enough. Don't move. Don't move. This looks awesome. No. I forgot to tell y'all, I moved to the PC version, that's why there's the Japanese subtitles. I'm playing the um, Japanese release. So the seamless HD mod would work, which looks really great. Get down! Awesome. We can't stay out here. Head to the police station. It'll be a lot safer. Because it's like the coolest police station ever. Full of art pieces. Crazy contraptions and puzzles. Okay. What's going on? I arrived in town and the whole place went Great. insane. The radio's out. You're a cop, Radio. Right? What's going on with that yeah. radio? First day on the job. Great, huh? Name's Leon Kennedy. Nice to meet you. Mine's Claire. Claire Redfield. I came to find my brother, Chris. Oh, 
Here comes the maniac. Hey, could you open the glove box? Sure. There's a gun inside. Better, Better take, take it, it with you. Ah! Watch out, Leon. He's got your cut. <laughs> Boom. You okay? Still in one Still piece. In one piece. <laughs> Sorry, y'all, I can't help it. Awesome. See, someone commented that this wreckage is somewhere in RE3 Where? near the trolley. I think that's where they said it was. I'm not sure. Don't quote me on that. I'll meet you there. Okay. Okay. <laughs> oh, this is awesome. And it's great that we're playing RE3 right now alongside of, of this. So this is just really fun for me to be back here on both timelines and look at this i dare i say the pc seamless it's the same mod it's just for different platforms but dare i say this one looks better clearer i'm not sure i don't know if, if exactly that is correct Freeze. or not but who are, who are you what are what you, you doing, doing here? here hold your fire i'm, I'm a, a human, human. <laughs> <sighs> Sorry about that. No babe? No babe for Leon? I thought you were one of them. But Leon's a babe. What's going on Just in look this at him. town? Hold on. I don't have a clue. By the time I noticed something was wrong, the entire city was infested with zombies. God, I love the tense build up to this one. Like the creepy sounds right now, the way he locked the door, you think you're safe right here, but you're kind of in like a little safe haven. I don't know. It's just, it's so different than RE3. And I, and you know, I just kind of played it. Like we, we played it in like the last few months. And I mean, it is a whirlwind of a game compared to, well, they're, these are both action packed and amazingly fun, but it's just a different introduction. All right, since we played this game before, I know that it's worth looting this guy. I'm, uh, I'm trying to come up with the best course of action here. Oh, come on, I almost got it. Knock them all down, knock them all down. No, they're gonna triple combo me. Get it, get it, get it, get it, get it. I'm trying not to waste my ammo. All right, the shotgun, okay. In Claire's playthrough, does she get the crossbow? Or is it RNG, like you get one or the other? I, uh, I'm trying, I'm gonna have to remember. It's been quite some time since we played Claire A, um, Leon B. But it's just crazy that just the two different scenarios you can draw so many differences from, you know? So I'm really excited. Um, one of the one of the amazing things about this game that made such a lasting impression, probably on all of us, but but definitely on me. I'm trying to do the quick turn. I have the quick turn enabled, by the way, on the uh, PC version with the mods. You know, I think enables that as an option. But uh, one of the amazing things about this game for me made a good, a good impression. Crap, crap, crap. I'm not going to be able to get through these guys. Was the differences from A to B. Like the freaking tension and build up set up in A. Like for exa example, when Claire went to the art room. I'm actually not sure what room, what it's called. Why am I already injured? What is this? Why did I do this to myself? Well, when she, anyway, when she went to the art room and we see the window above and nothing happens, right? We're cool. We just go through there. But then you play as Leon B, if I'm not mistaken. I'm remembering everything right. And it freaking falls through the freaking window that you thought was safe from the first time you played it. That's just, 
blows my mind. So I'm really excited to see the combination of things that can happen in this, you know, in these scenarios. I just had to stop and look at all that signage right there. I just think it's so cool. Hey, why are you right here? Oh, come on. Don't throw up on me. Come on, let me down. Dude, killing me. You're, you're actually killing me. God, I can't get hit again. Alright, I'm getting... I'm rusty. What is this? I did so good the first time I played this. Come on, let's get it together. Yeah. Alright, no one look at me. Don't look at me. Liquors. Not liquors. I mean, I was reading the signage. Liquors. Behind the... Anyway. Alright, we're gonna have to shoot this one. It's on the floor, I remember. There we go, there we go. Don't touch me, I might die. Okay, go, 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 go. <gasps> no. I'm out of here, dude. I'm out of here. <gasps> I meant to turn. Ooh, they have reach in this one. It's so much different than RE3. <gasps> oh. Okay, it's cool. I've recovered. <laughs> but yeah, in RE3, you can just narrowly escape through their clutches. Even if like they have their arms out, if you're just out of reach, you'd be okay. But these have such a longer reach. And for good reason. I think it's to... Well, this one I have the quick time... Quick turn, sorry, not quick time. I have the quick turn enabled, but I was gonna say for RE3, I think that difficulty... Hey, isn't there supposed to be an herb here? Or am I crazy? I think I'm losing my mind a little bit. I thought there was supposed to be an herby there. There's always an herb there, right? Maybe only in Claire's. In Claire Alien B, maybe. I don't know. It's been too long. Y'all are gonna have to refresh my memory. But yeah, I forgot to say, I hope y'all are doing freaking great. I'm always so excited to come back here, come to this wonderful world. Okay, card key. That's right, that's right. Uh, I guess we could say. I meant to combine. Um, I don't want the ink ribbon right now. It's, it's okay. So I think we go here first. It's so wild being here as Leon after I've been here so much, I feel like, as Jill oh. lately. Oh, man. Marvin, buddy. Who, who are you? Oh, you must be the new guy. Leon. Leon. Sorry, but it looks like your party has been canceled. What happened? About two months ago, there was this incident involving zombies in a mansion located in the outskirts of this city. Mm -hmm. Chris and the other STARS members discovered that Umbrella was behind everything. They risked their lives to reveal the truth, but no one believed them. Not long after that, all this started to happen. Freaking uh, uh, rats. Hang in there. Don't worry about me. Just rescue the survivors in the other rooms. Here, take this key card. You should be able to unlock the doors in the hall with this. Now go. But just go. Fine, but I'm coming back for you. Just hold on. What a freaking champion. Am I right? Marvin is incredible. All right, well, we got the key card, so this gives us access. Oh man, we're gonna get to access the whole map, the whole floor plan. I've been, you know, playing RE3 so much that I'm like only used to like one side now. I'm gonna have to remember everything again. Oh my gosh, this is gonna be huge. 
It's this is my second time playing it, basically. I mean, yeah, well, yeah, second time. Unless I like replay it or something to replay to like gather something somewhere else in the first initial playthrough, then this is like my pretty much second real full time playing it. But yeah, um, I'm gonna have to remember all this stuff. Especially the map. Alright, everybody, get together. Come on. A little closer. Come on, we can do better than that. There we go. You want some more? It's not dead. Alright, I'm just gonna wait for him to get back up. Oh, Irby, you have never, never looked hotter right now. Ooh, should we wait and, uh, or should we, uh, actually, this direction, I remember, is the conference room or the interrogation room, and both of these doors, I think, are going to be locked right now. There, there's another one. It's like a green door, and that's at the very end. I think they're both gonna be locked right now. I think we need to go here. Yeah. I, I think we get something from it. Oh boy. Oh boy. Come on, dude. Come on, dude. <gasps> I see his head. Y'all taught me that. Look. Alright. Is there anything over here? I don't remember. Oh, and by the way, tell me if there's... I mean, if you can even remember. It's been so freaking long. I wouldn't expect anyone to remember this. But if you can remember any things that you wanted to see that I didn't do, please let me know. I will be more than happy to find a note or get an extra item I missed or do something <gasps> like that I didn't complete yet. Okay, all right, all right. This just went... We're just gonna take this. Okay. Ooh, the save. I think there should be something back here. Oh. I could have mixed some. Oh, well. Oh, well, we're replaying this again, you know? It's gonna be, like, square one, y'all. Square one. Yeah, I don't know. I have no idea. Alright, y'all, let me through. Crazy. <gasps> you son of a... So annoying. Okay. Let me check this room. Uh, I don't want any ribbon quite yet. Anything else in here? Where's that? Oh! Shoot! Woo! You thought, sir. I'm out of here. I'm out of here. I'm checking this body and I'm dipping. Because I know there's something here. <laughs> Sheesh. I don't think we can even go through here yet. The upstairs should be locked, right? Okay, great. Now we can mix some herberonis. Mm -hmm. I know that's right. Alright, give me this. I'm taking it. I don't care. Oh, I forgot you have to engage the stairs like that. Uh, it's not like an RE3, we just go straight up. I don't want to mix these yet, let's hold off. Oh, it's locked, okay. Hmm, hmm. Then let's go check the other door on the opposite side of the precinct. Um, yeah, yeah, that's the plan. All right, where are these zombies gonna be at? Oh, I picked the right side. <laughs> Later, suckers. <laughs> I love when things like that happen. Little wins, you know? Little wins. Oh, ooh, the sounds. <gasps> you scared me. That's what I get for just running through doors. Well, he did. Again. Maybe we can get by the other one. Let's 
bring her over to this way. Yeah, we mm. got this. Oh, there's another one. Oh, oh, oh. Okay, a diamond. Hey, oh, look at you. Standing here all by yourself. Looking like a proper snack. Okay, club, diamond. That was a club, the other one was a diamond. This one is open! Oh yeah! Okay, okay. Key item. Oh no, this is not a key item. Um, key item's on the opposite side, see? That's where it is. It's a magic mirror. Uh, this is just to unlock things. If I am remembering correct. Oh, and as Leon, we have the lighter. Hmm. Whoa. The zombie sounds in RE2, I think, are my favorite. Like, I like the ones in 3, but I like that these are funnier and, and, and fun to imitate. I don't know. This is something great about them. Okay, so, we have a small key. We cannot get up there. We cannot go through those doors. Oh yeah, we're going across, that's right. I almost forgot our game plan, jeez. What am I thinking? Gonna need a medallion for that lady. Yeah, 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 over here, over here. Cool's cutscene ever coming up. Police memorandum. 8-23-1998. This letter is just to inform everyone about the recent movement of equipment that has happened during the precinct's rearrangement. The safe with the four-digit lock has been moved from the star's office on the second floor to the eastern office on the first floor. Two, two, three, six. Boom. We gotta go back. I'm doing it. I think there's a map in there. Uh, I'm gonna hold off on this. Hold off on that. There is a locked drawer here. I don't want to use it yet because I think it's just shotgun shells. If I'm remembering correct. Two, two, three, six. Remember that, y'all. All right, I'm gonna skedaddle there real quick. Two, two, three, six. Ooh, shotgun shells. Okay. All right. All right. We'll store them. Or I guess we can take it too. I don't know. Whatever. Whew. I'm out of here. I'm out of here. All right. On to the other side. All right. Here I be. I'm back. Um. Let's just hold off on this. Like I said, I think it's just shotgun shells. Not sure, but I don't think it's. Don't know how I forgot about that. It's like classic. Hey, this reminds me a lot, this window angle here. And you only get it that once, don't you? You don't get it again, do you? Not, dang it. Well, that reminded me of a panel of windows in Elisa. It's an awesome game made by indie developers that just recently came out maybe like a year ago or so or maybe like two years or maybe it has all the retro elements tank controls pre-rendered backgrounds survival horror elements of it it's so good and they took so many little moments of games that you would recognize now i really truly recognize and appreciate it now that i played re2 and 3 and it it's just it's just done so awesome. Anyway, they had like a moment like that with the window. That's not the window y'all are talking about, right? Uh, yeah, yeah, no, that's not the one. The window y'all are talking about is the one outside the save room, huh? In front of the staircase. Because Nemi jumps out of there. <laughs> oh yeah, we'll need a cord for that later. The head is missing. It seems to have been twisted off. Does not sound good, my boy. Neither does this. Let's kill it, what do y'all say? I, I'm feeling like killing. <laughs> I like this cutscene. Oh boy. Oh boy. So cool. All right, let's get it. Let's get it. Uh huh. One more. Come here. <gasps> oh. <laughs> That's satisfying, isn't it? 
It sure feels it. Uh. Yeah, all right. Sure, sure, sure. Yeah, we, we got this. Inventory's doing... We're doing okay. Main reason I wanted to do the PC version, um, instead of the GameCube version, now, for this playthrough, is simply for door skip. It saves a lot of time. It saves us both, you and me, a lot of time. Operation Report. September 26th. The Raccoon Police Department was unexpectedly attacked by zombies. Many have been injured. Even more were killed. During the attack, our communications equipment was destroyed and we no longer have contact with the outside. We've decided to carry out an operation with the intent of rescuing any possible survivors, as well as to prevent this disaster from spreading beyond Raccoon City. The details of the operation are as follows. Security of armaments and ammunition. Chief Irons has voiced concern regarding the issue of terrorism due to a series of recent unresolved incidents. On the very day before the zombies attack, he made the decision to relocate all weapons to scattered intervals throughout the building as a temporary measure to prevent their possible seizure. Unfortunately, this decision has made it extremely difficult for us to locate all ammunition caches. It has become our top priority to recover these scattered munitions. To unlock weapon storage, as stated earlier, blah, blah, however, consider supply. Okay, okay. I kind of want to, like, skip over like locations of things because I you know I played through the game before I think I'm gonna remember most of that generally um, but I'm gonna reread notes like this operation report September 27th 1 p.m. the West barricade has been broken through and another exchange ensued we sheltered the injured in a confiscation room on the first floor temporarily 12 more people were injured in the battle recorder David Ford additional report three additional people were killed following the sudden appearance of as of yet unknown creature this creature is identified by missing patches of skin and razor-like claws. However, its most distinguishing characteristic is its lance-like capable of piercing a human torso in an instant. Their numbers, as well as their location, remains unknown. We have tentatively named this creature the Licker and are currently in the process of developing countermeasures to deal with this new threat. God, I love these notes. They're perfect corporate emails, by the way. If y'all ever <laughs> want to you know, let your uppers know how you're doing on a project or what you're doing to ensure the project is done. Read this stuff and just just copy that. <laughs> Maybe not seriously, but you know what I'm saying. It's good. It's good inspiration. You know, it's very militant, very precise, clear, straight to the point. That's one thing I really liked about Resident Evil. Um, their notes. They're so punctual. Like I said, clear, concise, straight to the point. And it's just, I just love it. Oh yeah, so okay, we can get access to this very early. A sacrifice to the Hellfire. Other we wouldn't have otherwise been able to if we played Claire. Nice. Oh my god, the textures look so sharp there, oh my gosh. You could literally cut glass, it was so sharp. That fire. Now, if I'm not mistaken, I think like Claire's playthrough, there was something back there, no? Oh, look at here. I almost didn't catch that the first time. Okay. On the road. Watch out for the freaking window shutters. That scared the bejesus out of me the first time. Alright, how do we want to handle this room? <gasps> what? That was illegal. I'm reporting you guys to upper management. Oh, it's locked. It's diamond. This is- y'all- y'all told me this is the misty zombie. And I've noticed in RE2, there's not as many as in RE3, which was a cool upgrade for the game itself. <gasps> Son of a- dude, these stupid- No, no, they're gonna kill me, man. Why is this so much harder? <laughs> I'm gonna focus up, because this is kind of redonkulous. Alright, let's- let's take that. Let's pick this up. 
So we can get the other red gem right upstairs right now. And we can just take it on up to that room, that that relic room or whatever it's called. Oh yeah, baby. The music. Doom doom. I don't think there's anything in there. Uh, yeah, we'll save, we'll save. Special kind of key is required. Did I ever figure that out first time? Probably not. There's a note though, I'm gonna read it. Operation Report 2. Oops, sorry. September 28th, early morning, 2.30 a.m. Zombies overran the operation room and another battle broke out. We lost four more people, including David. David, my boy, we just read your letter. We're down to four people, including myself. We failed to secure the weapon's cache and hope for our survival continues to diminish. It won't last much longer. We agreed upon a plan to escape through the through the sewer. There's a path leading from the precinct underground to the sewage disposal plant. We should be able to access the sewers through there. The only drawback is that there is no guarantee the sewage disposal plant is free of any possible dangers. We know our chances in the sewers are slim, but anything is better than simply waiting here to die. In order to buy more time, we locked the only door leading to the underground, which is located in the eastern office. We left the key behind in the western office, since it's unlikely that any of those creatures have the intelligence to find it and unlock the door. I pray that this operation report will be helpful to whomever may find it. Elliot Edward. Got it. Key in the western with the door in the eastern part. I think that's what it said. Unless I have that confused. I very well could. Alright, uh, let's keep the gym with us, I think. Um, actually, no. I don't think we're gonna need it for, like, a while. Uh, let's save. Yeah, yeah. Yeah! Great new. Yeah, so these two right here, these kind of came with the PC version. I'm not sure what it means. Max. I I'm not sure. Max items? I don't know. Alright, we're all saved. Items put away that need to be put away. Please no zombies. Yeah, this window! That's why it's broken. Because of RE3. See, you guys rock, man. Like, if you do put anything like that, it's never like a spoiler. It's just something that I just really won't know until I know. So, it, it was just kind of cool. I, and I didn't look it up because I was like, I'm not going to. I'm going to stay blind in this. I don't know what they're talking about, but I'm not going to I'm not going to look it up. Like, window already too broken, you know? I just decided, no, I'm not going to. I'm going to I'm going to just see what they're talking about maybe one day. I wasn't even sure where I would find out what that meant was <laughs> or when I would find what that meant. You know what I'm saying. I'm getting tongue-tied. I don't know. Is this close enough? Yeah. Alright, which way should we go? Front or back? We go in front. Can I make it? Ooh! Clean! Just barely. Alright, let's see if my perception depth is, is right here. I think this is accurate. <laughs> I don't think it has to be super precise or anything. There it is. Got it. Should we go put it back? Mm. Nah. Let's keep going. We still have three slots. We're, we are. We are right. <gasps> Whoa. I'm backing up. We've got a lot of handgun bullets, so let's just use them. I don't want to use the shotgun. Saving those for the Lakers. So many police officers. <gasps> God, they're much more tonky in this one, I feel like. Oh, this is uh, locked as well. Oh, spade, spade, spade. Sorry, I'm trying to do the quick turn. There we go. One of these losers still alive? Okay, you guys done? Jeez. Uh, Alright. Hello? That was weird. 
First aid sprizzle! Various devices. This must be where they gathered information. Is that another shotgun? Do I really have two shotguns? How is that possible? So it must be RNG then. One of these two locations must be. Right? There's no way that... It <laughs> I guess I got really unlucky. I think probably the other option would be the grenade launcher, maybe? No, no, no. That's Claire that gets that. Y'all will have to tell me uh, what weapons go with whom. Alright, should we do this? Should we search this sucker for 50 times? I can't imagine why not, you know? Alright, what the heck? I'll do it for the... I'll do it for the memes. I'm skipping it though, so y'all don't have to watch. I'll just... I'll suffer through it so y'all don't have to. Okay, we gotta be close, right? I've gotta be at like 38 or something. I, I didn't count. I don't know, but we gotta be. <laughs> Alright, and I think we've om oh, almost collected everything. <gasps> Dang it. Look what I've done did to myself, y'all. Look what I've done did. And I am not taking that. I'm not doing it. Uh, We're gonna have to come back. That's just it. That's just... We will come back. Alright, just gonna go to the item box real quick. Meet you back here. Perfect timing now, actually. Uh, we can take this. I'm gonna put this away. Let's go ahead and get our, our meme. Wesker's obsession revealed. <laughs> it's such a weird picture. Like, it looks so composed in, like, four different ways. Amazing. The film D has now been filed. Okay, what do I need here? I got the two gems. Oh, yeah. Let's go ahead and take this. I think... Actually, no. I'm too ahead of myself. Uh... Hmm. Hmm. I am a bit ahead. I'm gonna put the gems away. And the lockpick. Okay. Alright. This is good. Um. Yeah. So now we go back up and... Continue what I was doing. All right, now I'm set. Let's get this going. Chris's diary. August 8th. I've talked to the chief today once again, but he refused to listen to me. I know for certain that Umbrella conducted T-virus research in that mansion. Anyone infected turns into a zombie. But the entire mansion went up in that explosion, along with any incriminating evidence. Since Umbrella, since Umbrella employs so many people in town, no one is willing to talk about the incident. Looks like I am running out of options. August 17th. We've been receiving a lot of local reports about strange monsters appearing at random throughout the city. This must be the work of Umbrella. August 24th. With the help of Jill and Barry, I finally obtained information vital to this case. Umbrella has begun research on the new G-virus, a variation of the original T-virus. Haven't they done enough damage already? We talked it over and have decided to fly to the main Umbrella headquarters in Europe. I won't tell my sister about this trip because doing so would put her in danger. Please forgive me, Claire. That's the epilogue file then, right? From RE3 that we saw? That's Chris was maybe depicted to be Leon. in Europe. Leon! It's good to see you're still among the living. It looks like we're not gonna find your brother here after all. no reason for us to stay any longer than necessary. Let's split up, look for any survivors, and get out of here. Right. One last thing. Here's a radio. Take it. That way we can keep in touch if anything happens. Mmm. Ba -da -ba -da. 
All right. Um, bye, baby Claire. We are all set, I think. Um, oh, we gotta go turn this in for the key. And I think we get the spade key first, if I'm remembering correct. I think so. What about this door? I didn't even check it. I... Okay. Oh, steal from the... Oh, okay. Alright, alright. We'll come through there later. Meow. Okay. Uh... Alright, let's go ahead and grab... Nah, 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 nah. Never mind, never mind. There's an item box. Um... Where am I going? God. Okay, here. <laughs> Sorry. My brain's like going three different directions at once. Alright. Watch out for the walls, y'all. <gasps> Sheesh. I even freaking knew it was coming and it still scares me. Oh. It's not that I forgot. I remembered. Clearly, I told y'all I, I remembered. It just... It just threw me off, that's all. Oh. We need to turn this in, as I said. Need to turn this coin in, get the kizzle. Oh god, please don't let me say that ever again. Let's just get the key, alright? And just get these doors opened. I think there's three? Maybe? Oh, it looks so cool. Thank you! <laughs> Spade. All right, so I'm gonna go to this one first. The one, this is like a a, a newsroom or a filing room or something. I think there should be a key item in in this one. Can't quite. Oh, I, I think like a crank or something. Patrol report. September 20th, 9.30 p.m. Reporter, Sergeant Neil Carson. We received a report of a suspicious individu individual skulking around the sewers in the outskirts of Raccoon City. I searched the area and located the individual, but he ran away before I was able to question him. I recovered the following items. A small amount of C4 plastic explosive, electronic detonator, 9x19 paraballon rounds, infrared scope broken. End of report. Was that supposed to be you know what I don't think anyone ever told me uh, I'll have to look it up then take the bullets okay yeah it's not necessarily a crank is it it's or maybe it is hold on let me see refresh my memory here yeah it is look at us look at us who would have thought we flying. All right. Um, next on the list, let's just keep going this way. I I am not sure if there's a door this way, but surely, surely we'll run. I think there is. Hold on. Mayhaps. Here, right. Oh, diamond, 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 diamond. All right. What about upstairs? Oh, yeah, yeah. Here at the end. Oh, cool. Only two. Boom, bada, boom, bam. I trusted it. I trusted my gut. Oh, boy. What's up? What are they eating? Just a body? This is different. Oh, shh! You son of a... This is different. I don't... I think here we met with Claire... When... Well, with Leon, when we played Claire. So, okay, I'm already starting to notice the differences. And they're giving us handgun bullets out the yin-yang. This is the drawer I was thinking about when I said I want to save the lockpick for it because I think a part is in there. A gun part. A good one. For the uh, handgun, if I'm not mistaken. Oh, I love the music in here. Ding dong, ding dong. Sorry, sorry. I'll stop. 
Um, why do I have an ink ribbon, by the way? Did I just straight up leave that in my inventory, or did I pick that up? I don't even remember. Alright, um, let's go to the item box. We need that lockpick, so I'm gonna go down right here. This angle's different, isn't it? try to grab me. Sneaky. And they sure do try to get the player with these angles through here. Oops. You done? But yeah, they really do try to get you with these really tight corners here with the zombie placements. It ain't safe. It ain't safe. Alright, doing the item box first. I don't know if this is the best rotation to do things. I'm just doing what I think. It's right here, you know, it's not far. Full pit stop. No problem. Alright, so here's what I'm thinking. I think we need this like now. There is a room where an item box is, so I don't know. I actually maybe this wasn't the best now I'm thinking of it. But oh well, here we are. Um, yeah. We don't need the crank. We don't need that freaking crank for like 10 years. Put it away. Get it away from my inventory. Alright, let's go with this. Let's just get rid of it. I don't want it walking around next time I pass through here. Okay, great. Uh, this should be an item room. We should get a key item, I think. Oh no, it's just a, um... Like a lockpick, basically. Magazine rack, nothing useful. Okay. Um, well, I, I, I can't separate it, can I? Ugh. Oh, it's kinda troll. Secretary's Diary A. April 6th. I accidentally moved one of the stone statues on the second floor when I leaned against it. When the chief found out about it, he was furious. I swear the guy nearly hit my head off, screaming at me never to touch the statue again. If it's so important, then maybe he shouldn't have put it out in the open like that. April 7th. I heard that all the art pieces from the chief's collection are rare items, literally worth hundreds of thousands of dollars. I don't know which is the bigger mystery where he finds those tacky things, or where he's getting the money to pay for them. May 10th. I wasn't surprised to see the chief come in today with yet another large picture frame in his hands. This time it was a really disturbing painting depicting a nude person being hanged. I was appalled by the expression on the chief's face as he leered at that painting. Why anyone would consider something like that to be a work of art is beyond my comprehension. Secretary has a good eye. She knows. This man's is disturbed. I think we know which painting it is. Isn't it the one that we burned, right? It's either that one or the one that Claire uses the emblems on. Behind, rather. You done? You got a friend? Ooh! You were waiting on me. Back up. Yeah, we can't get through here yet, right? Yep. Oh, it looks so cool. Look at this. Look at this. Look at Leon. It's looking so cool. Alright, let's get out of here. Before I freaking overstay my welcome. Sheesh, how long have I been going? Oh, not even an hour. We're doing good. Alright, watch it. We can unlock this. And I'm going to because I want to reset the birds. Cool. So, now that we can wrap around, um, this means we can go... Well, we're on the opposite side. Not yet. Not yet. I was thinking something, but I changed my mind. Just, oh god. I sort of forgot about this. I mean, the, the intensity of the moment, you know? 
Dun 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 dun. All right. Oh yeah, the water valve. So we can get to that helicopter. It's so creepy to me down here. All right, let's see. Oh, oh. All right, my juke moves. Not good. Whew. Barely made it through that guy. I don't think there's anything in the inner perimeter of that area. There's, I don't think there's anything out there. I think it's all in here. Nothing special. Probably, probably hasn't been working in some time. Yes, this is what we need. Uh, the handgun bullets, that's all. I don't need the uh, ink ribbon. And don't open that door. Alright, if you haven't played this, just trust me. Don't do what I did. Stop it. Don't do it. Just don't do it. Yo, we're all hoping I forgot, huh? Y'all were just thinking, ha, this sucker's about to forget. She's gonna walk right through that door. <laughs> not today, y'all. Not today. I remember some things. Alright. Time for the valve. Look at me carrying around these two gems like I thought I was about to do something with them. What a joke. Well, now we can. Good rule of thumb someone left me in the comments once is when you get a key item, it's pretty much safe to store. For a while. Like, you're not gonna need it. Hey, isn't there supposed to be something here? Dang it. Maybe only in Claire's playthrough, huh? Alright then. I searched it pretty thoroughly. Could be wrong, but... I, I Y'all saw. Y'all saw, okay? Don't look at me like that. I tried. God, where am I going? Um. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Back here, back here. We need to go back here. Sweet. Okay, let's hold off on the um, Yeah, let's go towards the juice. This is fine, this is fine. We can do it. Alright, let's do this. Grab this item here. I don't remember. Oh, the key's just sitting out in the open in here, huh? Alright then. Boom, baby. Did I skip that cutscene? I did, and I'm so sorry. Okay, so the plugs. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Okay, it's like kind of coming back. It's coming all back. Shotgun shells. Nothing inside. If I'm not mistaken, Claire finds an ink ribbon in here. I think. Okay, what should we do, everybody? We really need to go to the item box now. But, oh, we can't get through here just yet. Here I am ahead of myself again. Um, all right then, let's drop off some things. Definitely all of this needs to be dropped off. Oh, oh yeah, we got the key, we got the key, yeah, yeah. Uh, let's refill. Only one, but hey, you know, it's one. Okay, great. Um, I'm happy th with this. I'm fine. Now I have the uh, diamond key. There's a couple doors we can get to now. Uh, we can probably get to them faster through this outdoor walkway patio area, so let's do that. Wee! I'm having so much fun. I really do like this game. I'm not trying to say when I said RE3 became my one of my favorites. Um, RE2 is up there too on the list. I love the suspense in this one. I think it's well, it's a different kind of suspense in RE3, but it's definitely there. I don't want to say it's not present. It is. 
because of Nemesis is a freaking lethal, relentless pursuer. If that's not suspense, I don't know what is. But this one is... It's a little more subtle. You get so much buildup to something that's coming for you versus an RE3. Brad throws you right in is like, this thing's coming for us. And uh, it's just much more thrilling. So it's different, you know? I can appreciate both, but they're definitely up there in some of my favorite games, for sure. RE3 taking uh, precedence over this. But like I said, the zombie sounds are just done so good, or the monster sounds in this one. I love it. Court? First aid? Should we get it or nah? Uh... Yeah. Yeah, we'll get it, we'll get it. Should we kill this liquor that's gonna pop through? <gasps> Dude, how do I know it's gonna happen and still... <laughs> It still gets me, man. I swear I'm not faking it. <laughs> it just really... I knew it was about to bus out. Get it, get it, get it, get it, get it, get it. Leon, go! Okay, we're killing it, we're killing it. <gasps> Why didn't that shot count? Oh my gosh, that thing almost murdered me. Look at this waste. That was just a fair exchange and nothing more. Can we get through here? No, we can't. I've never come, gone, gone back into this room after I had left it because I didn't want any of that liquor smoke. Uh. <laughs> See that sound? It's just so good. Uh. Okay, so that's a club. All right, we're uh. done here. Uh. <laughs> Sounds like me when I wake up in the morning. Sounds like us all can relate. Alright, so, um, downstairs, by the item box, where the broken window is that Nemi came through. I think that is our next destination for this key. Yeah, I think so. Alright, so I'm just gonna meet y'all there. Okay, and I forgot. Yes. We can use one of these now. Okay, it's just handgun bullets. It's not even shotgun bullets like I thought. Um... <laughs> Excuse me, and then we can use the other one that's close to the library. Yeah, yeah. For sure, for sure. That's what we're doing right now. Yeah, yeah, this one. Woohoo! Perfect! Oh! It's going much better than I thought. You know, kind of. <gasps> Great, I have two shots. Come here, everybody get together. <gasps> what a waste. What a waste. Alright, come on. Get back, sons of... Hey, I got your arm. Okay, y'all. Uh, want to get together now, or what? Picture for prosperity? There we go. Who's next? Look at you. What do you think this is? You think I can't see you? If you just hold still, I won't see you. Oh, what? Oh, it's like a little edge. A little edge glitch, or not a glitch, but it thought it couldn't see me and I couldn't see it like the game. I couldn't even shoot it. All right, there's one more back here. I know because I remember. Come on, Leon. Mess him up. Mess him up. Uh. RPD, open up. Ooh. Ooh, it's open. Uh, yeah, contrary to RE3, it is open back there. Uh, what about anything here? Ooh. <gasps> If I had just opened this when I entered this room, my life would have been so much easier. But no. I did not think to start searching things until it was too late. Until I was wasting all my handgun ammunition. 
All right, it's time. Let's put down Marvin uh, uh, the best way possible. Actually, I don't know. Would this be the best way possible? It's kind of mean. I think he grabs you here and you can't get out of it, right? Dita! Dita! Oh, I got out of it. Nice. Wouldn't have been able to do that, I don't think, with the handgun. So, okay, this was a good choice. Ah, the heart key. Look at this. This game, I'm playing it the right way this time. It's a note to me. Congratulations on your assignment to the Raccoon City Police Department. We all look forward to having you as a part of our team. I promise to take good care of you. Welcome aboard from all the guys at the RP Fizzle. Oh, oh, guys. Oh, guys, stop. Stop it. It, it truly, it's, it's truly my pleasure. I'm having the time of my life, can't you tell? This is the best first day ever. Sweet! Unlocked. Marvin is such a man. He locked himself in there so he didn't hurt nobody. Hmm. Alright, let's put this away. What do y'all say? Uh, the film, I think... We, we can do it later. It's not necessary. We all know, you know what's on there. Um, put away there. How are we doing? We're doing good. I don't need to save. I'm okay. I'm feeling good. I'm feeling risky. Alright. I'm gonna load. Reload, rather. Combine. Uh-huh. Gotta stay stay up, everybody. Stay up. Alright, the heart key. Um we go up the ladder. Cross to the door. Uh, I think, I hope I'm remembering everything, the layout correct. Am I? Yeah, yeah, yeah. Yeah, it's this way. Go around here. Go through this door. Uh, the heart key. Oh, wait, wait, wait. Am I getting it confused? No, no, no. This is right. We go downstairs, though. I could have just stayed downstairs. I don't know why I thought this. Why did I think this? But this was better. It's not. I could have just went through the door right there in the main first level lobby. I guess because I was thinking of the door being right here closer to this side of the ladder or the, the staircase. That's why I thought this would be the best way to go. But technically no. I think we would have gotten here faster had I just went through the first floor door right there. All right, we've done it. I forgot my freaking cord because I kind of sort of didn't remember that this was coming up so fast. That door back there is locked. There's shotgun ammunition there. I can see it. I didn't know it'd be there, but I saw it. I don't need it. We're gonna hold off on that. Let's just go down here and destroy these liquors or dogs or whatever's here. <gasps> Crap. Come on, run! Shotgun's so slow! One more? Okay, phew. This part of the game always kind of messed me up. Now I kind of want to go back for those shotgun uh, bullets. I think we're going to need them. But this part of the game takes like a weird turn, I feel, in difficulty coming down here. Things are really start to heat up. Let's go down the manhole. Yeah. Yeah. Take me down the manhole. <laughs> the ambience. Alright, perfect. We can reload. Perfect, perfect, perfect. Should we... Yeah, let's be safe. Let's be safe. Uh, yes. Yeah, yeah. Let's be safe. Let's be safe. Let's put away the key. I kind of didn't go where I really wanted to go so far <laughs> yet. Uh, but it's okay. We can keep going. I didn't mean to do that. Just searching this room, I don't recall if there's a whole lot in there. I don't think so. <gasps> oh! 
Oh, I didn't know I could climb up this. Like, I... Maybe I forgot? But I thought I tried as Claire and I couldn't, like, it wouldn't let me go up there. Huh. I probably had only forgotten. Anyway. So, that will be important later, I gather. Not so important for Leon's playthrough. I almost didn't have to come down here, really. They got me. I'm limping. Uh, we're gonna need this. Autopsy room. Locked. Oh, club key, huh? Power room. Oh, yeah, there's a door. A weapon room. To our... Left. Well, Leon's left. Right down the hall, right? And in order to get there, it's a two-lock system. I think this is the first part. Doing this power. Uh, yeah, we'll take this. And then the second part is... You know what? I... I don't remember. Please be one. Okay. Basement. Anything else? All right. That's right, we have to balance this out. Uh, we start with up, I guess. Start with up again. Sure, why not? Uh, take it down 14. Uh, down another, and then up. Bing! Okay. Card! That's what we need in there. A card key. Which we do not have. But we will have. Uh... I think we get it after the club key when we unlock the door down the end of the hall. I think the card's in there. On a body or something. <gasps> I forget! We meet the love of my life today, right now, in this playthrough. <laughs> ow, ow, ow! Sorry about that. When I saw the uniform, I thought you were another zombie. That's fair. Who are you? <laughs> Who are Ada you? Wong. And what are you doing here? I'm and what are you doing ben. here? He's one of those reporter types, always looking for a scoop. I heard he was locked up in the cell block, only there's a wrecked car barring the entrance. I've been trying to find another way inside. If we work together, we can move this thing. Give me a hand here, will you? I gotcha, girly. No problem. Anything for you. Let's do it. Awesome. Uh, two herbs at the end. Hey, her portrait's here. I never knew that. Ah, because we're together. That makes sense. Obviously. Alright, cool. Two green herbs. I don't want to mix them yet. Let's hold off. I'm going to take my new found, new found friend into the cells. Ada, wait! Ada, wait! <laughs> She's like, boy, I have things to do. Uh, actually, I kind of regret taking this door first. I think we should take... Yeah. The... Yeah, no. Uh, we need something for that room. I think we need, like, a lever or a... Something for the manhole. Let's go talk to this fella here first. Anything in here? Ooh, a blue herb and a green herb. Sure, I'll take it. I'm kind of full though. Oh yeah, this. Bum, bum. Let me guess. You must be Ben, right? Get Let up me guess. now. What do you want? I'm trying to sleep here. Is this the guy? Ben? 
You told the city officials that you knew something about what's been going on, didn't you? What did you tell them? And who the heck are you? I'm trying to find my boyfriend. His name's John. Leon's he was like... working for a branch office of Umbrella, based in Chicago, but he suddenly disappeared six months ago. I heard a rumor that he's here in the city. I don't know anything. And even if I did, why would I want to tell you? Okay, I say we leave him in there. Does <laughs> anyone know where they put the key to this cell? I have it right here, officer. But I'm not about to leave this cell. Those zombies aren't the only things crawling around out there. Roar! <laughs> like I said, I'm not leaving this cell. Such a cool part. Get out of here before you lead it right to me. Hey, I'm not going anywhere. I'm the only cop left alive in this building. What? Look, if you want to live, then you're going to have to leave with me. <laughs> but you're going to have to leave with me. Do you even me? know how to get out of the city? There's a kennel in the back of the building. Inside the kennel is a manhole. Go through and it'll lead you That's to the sewer entrance. That's the one we need. But it won't be easy. All right, I'm going. Eight to wait. No, he didn't say it. All right, we need this. Manhole opener. <laughs> That's the name of it. Awesome. I thought it was something a little more sophisticated, but that's straightforward. That's exactly what it is. Labeled for intended use. All right, so don't let me forget, we need a club key still. And the card key for the weapon area. And... Okay, we're just doing this. I am not messing with those doggies. The small key I have. I need to use it to get the freaking handgun part. What am I doing? I'm wasting so much time. This is bonkers. Should we go back? Oh, come on, dude. Come on, dude. Get out of here. They're so freaking cute. All right, I, I, I'm, I'm poisoned. Great. There's an item room. Uh, here is where the chess pieces are placed. Chess plugs. Anything else in here? I don't think so. I gotta get rid of this poison ASAP. Yep, yep. We need four, four of them. I don't have a blue herb in the item room. We're gonna have to go back. Oh, sheesh, it scared me. I don't think I've introduced myself yet. My name's Leon. I'm with the RPD. <laughs> and? Your it's point? It's a dead end. You think we can get upstairs through this shaft? Give me a boost. I'll go and check. Best moment of Leon's life right there. <laughs> Just kidding. Whoa, that was weird the way she fell in. Did y'all see that? She looked like a spider for a second. All right, Ada, my girl. Later, losers. Uh, I think this is the intended way we go. Right? Oh, no, 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 this is extra. Yeah, yeah. Haha. <laughs> Score. That'll be for Leon. At least I think so. Alright, so now we get to the other door. And instead of, uh, I guess Cheryl doing the, this room? So Ada does? Yeah. That makes sense. Let's take this. Just in case. Yeah. Yeah. Uh, we don't do anything here yet. We got to move the boxes.
Sweet. Okay, great. Here I was thinking, oh, come on, quick turn. Here I was thinking the whole time I needed to like go back and find it or something. No, club key is gathered here and thrown over. And I gotta cure Leon of his poison, dude. Leon, can you hear me? Ada, did you find anything? Right here. That's cool, he's carrying the weapon equipped. Fast. Here's one more. Yeah. Nice. Hey, I can't reach the ventilation hole. I'm going to have to find another way around. I'll catch up with you later. What? Ada, wait! <laughs> She's got it, big boy, don't you worry. She is an elite operative herself. Okay, perfect. We need to drop off some things. And, oh, ooh, thank you. Oh my gosh, the game knows. Uh, but first... Okay, we got a lot of green herbs here. Like a lot. Uh, let's take this. Definitely that. And a small key. And I'm gonna go back to the precinct and kind of, you know, tighten up the loose ends. Doom, ding, dun, dun, dun. Okay, there we go. Uh, let's put this back just to save space. We're good. Ooh, we're caution though. We should do a green on green mix, even though it's not the best, I know. But just to keep ourselves afloat, I don't need the uh, ink ribbon. I'm just gonna keep going. I'm probably just gonna play this till I drop, you know, till I get tired. I usually do like one hour videos ish. <gasps> Did you poison me? Oh, thank god. Just for you know, ease of, like, viewability. Like, I do one-hour videos just for, like, you know, digestible episodes. Do we want to go check these? I think that's the only thing... <gasps> yes! Yes, 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 yes. I want this. Go, 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 go! Worth. Red herb, always worth. Uh, but yeah, for, for this, it's just such a fun game, you know, and I'm familiar with it now that I've played it once. Claire A. Leon B. That, you know, I just want to kind of go till... I don't know when. A good stopping point, I guess. Um... Cool. We can open up that door now, right down the, the way here. Yeah, yeah, down here. I think there's gonna be liquors. time you have to plan it with liquors you you can't be too close even if you think you're far you maybe need to back up even more all right let's try to get out of these <gasps> unscathed oh i love that animation i'm out of here i'm out of here no get off me Have what we need. Liquor's gone. Let's use the key card here. Awesome. Now we're finally getting arsenal, which I should have unlocked that door, or not that door, the drawer outside of the library a long time ago. And honestly, I think it was a big missed opportunity that I didn't go to the library early on in the playthrough. Because I could have just been here and stayed here, used all the night and rook plugs. Um, ooh, decision time. Um, hmm. I think I'm gonna take this eye pack. And I heard from, um, you know, the community commenting and letting me know that you can take both if you want. Pretty cool. Did not know that. Ouch, that hurt my ears. 
Uh, no, sorry. I didn't mean to go here. I meant to go down the hall. Okay, yeah. It was a mistake not going to the library. Um, because now, look, we have to go all the way- well, we have to go- uh, whatever. We have to go all the way back anyway. I forgot I have the club key. I guess no big. Okay. Here we go. Uh, drop this off. Perfect. I- I- I think after playing it once, I prefer to use, um, the shutter- the cable there. Or cord, rather. Cool, so I think the cl the last club door, if there is one more, there might be two, but I think there's one. It's that green door at the end of the conference room or interrogation room hallway. Nothing in this locker. Goodness gracious, I have so many shotguns. Sh I'm, not, I'm not complaining, but sheesh. <gasps> Ooh, baby. Watchman's Diary. This is one of my favorite notes. I don't know why. I just... It's so suspenseful. It has good build-up. And then I like the like, his kind of recollection of like what's going on. It's just a fun read. August 11th. I finally had the chance to see blue skies for the first time in ages, but it did little to lift my spirits. I was reprimanded by the chief for neglecting my duties while I was up on the clock tower. There's only one thing I still don't understand. Chief seemed to be more concerned about the fact that I was up on the tower rather than that I was neglecting my duties. Why was access to the tower prohibited in the first place anyway? September 5th. I recently talked to the old man who works in the scrapyard out back. His name is Thomas. He's a quiet man and really seems to enjoy chess. He even went so far as to design a special key and lock engraved with chess pieces on them for one of the doors in the disposal yard. We may plan to play chess tomorrow night. I can't help but wonder how good he is. One thing that's been bothering me about him is the way he's always scratching himself. Does he have some sort of skin disease, or is he just rude? September 9th. Thomas was a much better player than I had imagined. I used to think of myself as a fairly decent player, but he did a pretty good job at humbling me. About the only thing I imagine that could match his skills in chess is his appetite. All the guy does was talk about food throughout the entire game. He sounded fairly healthy, but he didn't look quite right. I wonder if he's okay. September 12th. I was supposed to play another game of chess with Thomas, but we had to cancel it because he hasn't been feeling too well. He stopped by to see me, but I told him to go back and rest since he literally looked like the walking dead. He insisted that he was just fine, but I could tell he was really having problems. Come to think of it, I haven't really been feeling too good myself lately. I just think that's a cool, cool note. It's like a little story, basically. Kind of reminds me a little bit of... of the note we found in like the closet room in RE- Jeez, that scared me. Uh, in RE1. Alright, Herb. I'm taking you. Come on, get in the truck. Alright, Jesus. Let's finally go to the library. I feel like it should have been done like forever ago. Oh my gosh. Alright, so I should be- Yeah, we're actually- We're close to the door I need. But I don't care. I'm going to the library. It's been too long. I want that part for the gun. And uh, I think it's going to come in handy. <gasps> Did y'all see how I wasn't paying attention going up that ladder? I was just getting all comfortable. <sighs> I, yeah, I, this game will... It will rock you. If you're not careful. I'm taking this. Okay. Now. The library should be... He, uh... Yeah. <gasps> oh, that's when they enter. Yes. Yes. I don't think I need to go that way. For a little bit. So I'm good. Uh, let's grab this, definitely. It's gonna be worth to have that with us. Alright, let's go ahead and do this. Oh wait, wrong way, sorry. Here we go. We need to come through here first. Get this bread. 
Yes, God, this should have been done so early. All right, well, it's been done now. Sweet. And we have Magnum. Totally gonna save that though for later. All right, let's do this puzzle real quick. Shouldn't take us too long. And I believe we, we do have the crank, of course. But using the crank on the third floor, um, oh yeah, we don't we don't do anything. We push the button here. But I think it's a two part thing that we need for the third floor, right? Like we we don't we don't need to do anything yet. Sorry, I did it the wrong way. Right. Um. Right. And I think right. If I'm remembering correct. Yeah. Okay, so we have all the chest pieces, don't we? Or the plugs? I think we do. Maybe not, maybe not. We still have to go to the chief's office. Okay, so yeah, I don't think we need to go to the third floor yet. That's just gonna require the, cr the crank and one other thing. I don't remember what it is. I think it's a part for the, the clock. So I don't think we need that yet. Or we don't need to go there yet. Uh, what was I doing? Okay, yeah, we can we can do all the parts now. Uh, and go to the last club door, which is downstairs. Yeah, so we can actually. It might be it it, it will be faster. Okay, if I if I do it this way, I get a little confused on this side of the map. God, I can only imagine how Claire's playthrough is going to be. My gosh. Because I felt like Leon- I felt like Leon B was brutal. Just because it was so different, you know, from the A scenario. From Claire's, I mean, rather. The- the- the, um, sense of urgency or, like, rather the- the terror, I don't know, just the amount of action. It was much different. Do we need that film? I don't think we do. I don't- I don't- I'm not gonna get it. If we need it, let me know if- I- I don't think so, though. Alright, so we light a fire. This is nice as Leon. We don't have to, uh... We don't have to go back to the item box. How do we even play in Claire? Come on, I know there's an item in here. Right? I know there is. Or, or at least in Claire and... Claire A. Leon B. I thought there was. Okay, I guess not. Alright, so I think it was Jack... Uh, King... King... Oh, look at the textures! I have not seen a glitch like that before. Especially with the HD mod. I wonder why that is. Hmm, interesting. Okay. Uh, and then did it say... Wait, that's 13. This is 12. Uh, I think it was Queen and then King? H hold on, let me, let me go... Let me check. Uh... Oh, sorry. I messed up. Queen. King. Then Jack. Okay, okay. So I messed up. Let's just, let's just start over. Yeah, look at that, the textures. Oopsie. Alright, so Queen. Right? Oops, no, that's the Queen. See, I messed up again. Okay, okay, I got this, I got this. Queen. Uh, king. There we go. Look at that, that's so weird. I've never seen an error like that before. Like, ever. Alright, we'll take this. Now we can go up to the third floor. Alright, we're tying up all the loose ends now. It's starting to feel good. So. Uh... Yeah, we've we've done everything. We've we've got the now now the question is actually I do think we go up to the third floor now. Yeah, cuz that might be where we get the last chest the the plug. I thought we had them all, and we don't. So, let me grab uh, let me go to the item box real quick cuz I'm going to grab everything. And probably just go there and save. 
or save after, you know, I get the plug. I think so. Uh, da -da -da. Let's put away the magnum. Let's keep the shoddy, I guess. And maybe less. Yeah, and he and oh, oh, now look what I did. Jesus, now I don't want to take it with me. Okay, let's do this. And we'll need the crank. Let's put the plug back. Okay, yeah, see, we got three. Cool, so we'll go get the last one right now. Okay. All right, here we are. Library, third floor. Third floor of the precinct, rather. Liquor should be here. Oh! Contrary to what I thought, liquor is not present. Not yet. Anyway. Okay, two-part system here. We're gonna crank that. Then we're gonna use this part. Get the plug, I believe. And then we're all set. Excuse me. Jesus. The lip of that staircase always gets me. It's a little wonky. Alright. Boom. Boom. Bam. Now if I'm not mistaken, can't we enter or exit through here at some point? Oh yeah, we can jump down. Where the heck does this take us again? Uh, let me think, let me think. This probably is the best thing to do. Because all we need is an item box. To get the bishop plugs and we're all set. And we move forward. Yeah, yeah, okay, this is great. No! Holy crap. <gasps> Dude, how did it get in there? That's what I want to know. If I were Leon, I'd be like, not my business. Turn around and go the opposite way. The freaking eye and the arm is so cool. Okay, uh, nope. Uh, I don't want to do uh, anything with that. Uh... Do we we do have to go that way actually? Uh, all right, I'll go. I'll check his body out. I think it says some unique dialogue or something too. Ben. Oh yeah, little cutscene. See, Can I forgot all about me? this. Come on, answer. Damn, I don't believe this. I almost got the story. <laughs> ben. Uh. <laughs> Bitter irony. The chief of police, a co-conspirator. Mm-hmm. Get that scum. Get that Make scum. Him pay. <laughs> Hang in there, Ben. Roger that. Oh my chest! It's burning! What's wrong? What's wrong? <laughs> Yikes. Oof. That's nasty. Alright, I'm glad I checked this out. <gasps> Ada! God, what was that? Mail to the Chief. To Mr. Brian Irons, Chief of the Raccoon City Police Department. We have lost the Mansion Lab facility due to the actions of the renegade operative, Albert Wesker. Fortunately, his interference will have no lasting effects upon our continued virus research. Our only present concern is the presence of the remaining STARS members, Redfield, Valentine, Burton, Chambers, and Vickers. If it comes to light that the STARS have any evidence as to the activities of our research, dispose of them in such a manner that would appear to be purely accidental. Continue to monitor, the, monitor their progress and make certain their knowledge does not go public. Annette will continue to be your contact throughout this affair. William Birkin to Mr. Brian Irons, Chief of the Raccoon City Police Department. I have deposited the amount of U.S. $10,000 to the account for your services this term as per our agreement. The development of the G-Virus scheduled to replace the T-Virus is near completion. Once completed, I am certain that I will be appointed to be a member of the Executive Board for Umbrella Incorporated. It is imperative that we proceed with extreme caution. 
Redfield and the remaining STARS members are still attempting to recover information on the project. Continue to monitor their activities and block all attempts to investigate the underground research facilities. William Birkin. We have a problem. I have received information informing me that Umbrella HQ has sent spies to recover my research on the G virus. There are an unknown number of agents involved. They must not be allowed to take this project away from me as it represents my entire life's work. Search the city thoroughly for any suspicious persons. Detain any such individuals by whatever means deemed necessary and contact me immediately through a net. With these precautions, any possible threats should be eliminated. I will not allow anyone to steal my work on the G-Virus, not even Umbrella. Where are you going, Ada? To the chemical plant. I have a feeling that's where I'll find John. Ada, wait! Hey! Do you read me, Claire? We now have access to the back of the parking lot. Got it. I'm getting out of here and heading to the sewer. Can you meet me there? I'm on my way. <laughs> Why does she sound like that? I'm on my way. I, I don't quite remember. I guess we'll see. But she kind of says it very reluctantly. Okay, so now that we've done that, I think we just drop right through here, right? Through the manhole? Watch out, watch out, watch out. Um... I think so, I think so. Watch out for the- oh my god. They wanted my blood. Okay, here we go. So, I just go in here, grab what I need, and... Uh, I can't remember, but I think this fight has something specific to it. Like it's time-based, rather than like damage-based, uh, I guess? Or, or maybe it is, I don't know what I'm thinking. Let's take this just in case. Who knows, man, who knows? Alright, I don't plan on dying, so I'm not gonna save, okay? I'm, I'm playing risky. Risky, alright? I don't even care. I feel confident. Oh! This is entirely different. Ew. Yeah, we faced this on Claire's playthrough below. The chief's office. Oh, it's so nasty. Alright, I don't like this one. I forgot the extra little buggies. Uh-huh. Not taking any chances. Let's get away. Uh, reload. Run. It's gonna throw up on me. Is he done? Oh no, not the babies. Oh, come on! I did this wrong way. Get off me, you son of a... You nasties. <gasps> it's on me. It's so gross. Get off me, you crazy. Yeah, get off me. Get off. Stop. I'm out of here. Oof. I hope that thing didn't drop anything. I don't think so. Oof. We could go back and check, I guess. Why not? See if our friends are still in here. I don't think so. Oh, the body's just gone. Awesome. All right. Well, I'll never know. I don't. I don't think it drops anything though. Whew. Easy. And there she is. Ada. She finds what sneaky was that ways all about? around. Running off like that was reckless and stupid. Those zombies are everywhere. Not to mention that thing that got Ben. I was there, Leon. I know. <laughs> look, Ada. As an officer, it's my job to look out for you. But we're not going to get through this alive if we don't work together. Okay? All right. We'll do this your way for now. For now. 
<laughs> All right, let's do it. My girl is back at my side. Not for very long, though. Fleeting, but fun. I don't think I'm going to grab those herbs. We'll just remember they're there. I do think, however, I am going to save. So, yep, there's Ink Ribbon. Perfect. Okay. All right. Hopefully I didn't like skip over anything that y'all really wanted to see. If you do, let me know. I will go back. I don't care. I will load up that old save file. I will go back. I will do it for y'all. Let me know. So far though, I think it's going pretty good. I'm enjoying it. It's so much fun. I can't wait to get to Claire B though. I think that's going to be really intense. But anyway, thank y'all so much for watching. I hope y'all enjoyed it and I will catch y'all on the next one. Ciao!